everybody, it's Craig at The Dog Therapist. I'm here today with the winner of our January competition. This is Gwen and this is the lovely Roxy. So our competition was to win a one hour, 30 minute session with me where I could fix your healing problems. Now, you'll see the before and after in a, in a bit. So Gwen, just, just tell everybody, I know it's a bit funny if we do an interview, but t- tell everybody a little bit about, a little bit about Roxy and how, how she pulled and, and, yeah. and what we've done today. Yeah, well, she's a very nervous dog and she's been very, very hard to even get her outside. Yeah. Um, it's amazing what, what she's done with the help of Craig today. Um, I can't believe it, really. <laughs> 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 well, we're going to go and have another go and try, aren't we? Yeah. She wouldn't even go near to Craig when he first arrived. No, she, wouldn't, she wouldn't even come near me. Yeah. It, took, it literally took 40 minutes because she's such, such a nervous dog. It took at least 40, 45 minutes until she'd come and let, let me stroke her. Yeah. Uh, and then we went over the field, didn't we? Yeah. And then we did some, did some heel work. And you'll, like I say, you'll see the before and the after video in a minute. Uh, and it just it just works. So you, you know the, the little technique that I use? Yes. Um, just tell everybody a little bit about it and, and how, how easy it is to do. Yeah. Well, I think, first of all, you've got to have the right type Equipment, of lead. Equipment, you? have the yeah. right lead yeah. first, yeah. I mean, yeah. I, I've spent a fortune on various types of yeah. leads and harnesses, etc. Um, uh, and it's giving her the, the, the slack, the yeah. loose. Yeah and she's not pulling, then when you <coughs> start to pull, yeah. there's a technique, you just pull it sort of down the back, and well, you are in control. Yeah, it kind of like communicates I the dog, doesn't it? I wasn't yeah. in control before. Yeah, yeah. I was letting her take, take over me, yeah. basically. Yeah. And, and when, when you could see her actually walking at your pace, yeah. how did that feel for you? Wonderful, amazing. Yeah, yeah. Did it, yeah. 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 Nobody will believe us. Nobody will believe us. <laughs> well, I'm, I'm glad to help you today. And all you've got to do is keep up the good work. So yeah. keep, keep doing what, what we've been doing today. Yeah. Um, and you can, because she's a lovely little girl, Roxy, as you can everyone can see there, how beautiful <laughs> she is. And you just, just keep up the good work and you'll have a well, a well balanced, well behaved dog. Right, thank you very oh, much. My, 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 my pleasure, no problem at <laughs> all. No problem. So, everybody, there's, there's three or four different ways that we can help you. Obviously, you can do a one to one session like we've done here today. There's the online coaching where you send us the videos and we coach you that way. Uh, and we've got some fantastic results doing that way. The other way is we do local classes. We do classes in Newcastle under Lyme and Maidley. And then the last way is, is we do group behavioural dog walks where dogs that have got um, reactivity problems, where they want to bark at the dogs or they're just a pain when they pull into all the dogs, you can come on one of our uh, group behavioural walks as well. But all you've got to do is, is pop on over to thedogtherapist.co.uk and we'll see you all soon. Okay, everybody, so this is Gwen, this is Roxy, this is before we had the session. As you can see, Roxy is a big, big puller on the lead here. Um, Gwen really, really struggled to keep Roxy under control. I mean, you can see how far she's in front of her there. Um, I mean, really, really dangerous. I mean, look now, crossing the road, you can see she's really tugging her across the road. So this is something that we need to fix and fix really quick. So so this lovely lady can obviously... um, have nice, lovely dog walks. Okay, I've now trained Roxy. I had about maybe five to 10 minutes with her and I got her to walk to heal correctly. Can you see now that Roxy now is with Gwen and you can see how she's walking. Looks how she's checking in with Gwen all the time. She keeps looking up to Gwen. She's making sure she's in the right position. Watch how Gwen now, based on my how I've shown her how to use my technique. She's just tugging the lead, tiny little bit. She's using a, a growly voice and she's going, ah, 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 ah. So she's making sure that she doesn't come in front anymore. What she's done now is she's setting in rules and regulations. She's setting guidelines now of how Roxy should behave when, when she should walk to heel. So just look, watch how, look, can you, see the, can you see how Roxy now is checking in with, with Gwen, checking in with the owner? She's making sure she's in that right position every single time. And what's happening now is, is Roxy's walking at Gwen's pace rather than the other way around how it used to be. So just keep, just keep looking. I mean, it's beautiful to see. Again, look how she's checking in. Got a very, very nice loose lead. And this is the only way that you're ever going to get your dog to heal is if you have a nice loose lead and you keep checking in with the dog, pulling the lead back and telling it to heal. Look at that. It's like a different dog. Great work by Gwen. Well done. What a fantastic win of the competition as well. Really, really pleased.